Good evening on what is, I regret to have to report, a pretty unpleasant night. The rain has been lashing down here. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And with the start of the league season just days away now, we have action from the curtain raiser for you to enjoy. Stuart, your expectations? Well, I have to say, Derek, I'm really looking forward to this. Both these sides did so well to win their respective cups. I think this should be close tonight. In the battle for the UEFA Super Cup, they're underway now. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Thomas Partey in the centre of midfield. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. Cross fired over. Now the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. Chance to do damage. Could be. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Not much time to make up his mind. Good visualisation and execution. And a goal! 1-0! And what a fast start they've made to this game! Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? He continues his run. missing the target well they're at least making chances now they need to be more clinical a good effective pressure high up the pitch and offside it is Partey has lost it. Dina Ebambe takes aim and he's got and scored to level us again. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So back underway, following the equaliser. Might really be able to trouble them here. And space for the cross. And a goal! In the lead again! Fully deserved! Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Brian Tristante. Might be able to produce from this position. Now can they make something happen? But a crucial intervention inside the box. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Can they take advantage of the situation? Chance to finish. And how about that for a save? 
Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. Well, he's lost it. Otavio. Well, not cleared away completely. Bukayo Saka. Promising looking ball. Offside it is. Such a pity for him. Well, he thought he was onside, but I think the assistant got that absolutely right. Mbappe. Well, the timing was perfect. Ball one. So on the cusp of the half-time interval, it's Arsenal holding the edge here. Stuart, time for your assessment of what you've seen from them. Yeah, it's certainly been an open game, but on the balance of play, I think they do deserve their lead. They just have that little bit more creativity, particularly in the wide areas. Oh, the chance is on, Stuart. Oh, that's a fine save. Cristante, well, nicely cut out. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Thomas Partey. Partey. Oh, good-looking run. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. And the second half in this UEFA Super Cup tussle is underway here. Wanted to keep it but couldn't. Looking confident with the ball at his feet and pushed away to safety. Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. Might it be Mbappe? A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So on with the action and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? They could pick out a teammate. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And what a finish it is. He times his run well, gets above it and gives the keeper no chance. That's a top-class goal. Well, back underway, and a glut of goals here, 3-2. Can he do it? Oh, magnificent from the keeper, fantastic stop. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent.
Cannon. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Must be! Oh, wonderful save! Will he... react so quickly there that's a great save and there's the delivery and he clears the danger oh great vision and making the run to the inside oh no it's gone a begging well they can't miss opportunities like that what a chance to equalize Ollie Watkins. Oh, far from the ideal pass. Nicolo Zaniolo. Dina Ebambe. And fired against the crossbar. This could square the game, but the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. White. Watkins. This attack looks highly promising. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. 20 minutes remaining. Well, they have the ball once more. Offside, a tight one. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Couldn't hang on to it. Thomas Partey, Coutinho, now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now, an alert intervention, and the counter attack is on, options available, all hands on deck, fantastic work to thwart the danger, Foul there, free kick awarded. Well, he knows he's on his last warning after that one. Well, I don't think it warranted a yellow card. He made a genuine attempt to play the ball there. It comes to nothing in the end. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. This could finish it! Oh, a smart save. And that keeps them in with a chance. Well, there's still a bit of time left. Can this inspire them to go and get the equaliser? It might still be problematic. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Ocampos. On the ball, Zaniolo. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. Lucas Ocampos. Very difficult challenge to perform, but he succeeded. Gabriel Martinelli. Bukayo Saka. And a strong tackle. And threading it forward. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. That could cost them at this late stage. Well, that should have been the equaliser. I'm not sure they'll get another chance now.
Ben White. Tierney. And full time, most satisfying a victory in the curtain raiser to the season. Well, it's certainly a good way to start the season. That's just what they wanted. They played really well today, and it's always great to keep winning trophies. First piece of silverware, and that is never to be sniffed at. As the players applaud the fans who have been backing them today. Well, it's great preparation for the season, Derek, and this is always a nice moment going up to lift any trophy. Great for those fans as well. Now for the trophy lift. And with friends and family in attendance, you've always got to really savour these moments when they come around, Stuart. Well, they've got to enjoy this, Derek, and then get ready for a tough season ahead. They won't be celebrating too much tonight. Absolutely, Stuart. They all know the show must go on after this. And now the players posing for the images that will be sent around the world. Well, these are great moments, aren't they? Certainly ones to cherish, and there will more of this come the end of the season. Good visualisation and execution. Just a couple of questions for you. That'll be all, thank you.